I'm recreating some of the most insane long exposure photos from viral TikToks, including this one where this guy literally draws an entire dinosaur, and this one of this crazy abstract design. I don't have much experience with long exposure photography, so this is going to be really hard. But first, we're going to start with this video here. It's from Kyle Nutt, and he uses a light bar to create a circular portal for a spacesuit. What? This photo shoot was straight out of the Interstellar movie. So we get to this location an hour before sunrise, there's mist in the air, we're surrounded by these crazy rock formations. Then our astronaut climbs up to the top of this rock, his headlights are beaming through the fog, and I instantly knew what I had to do. I start testing out different long exposure ideas, but I knew it had to be one circle. I kept trying over and over, but it's actually surprisingly hard to make a perfect circle with a light. At this point, we're running out of time, the sun's coming up, we have to do this now. I run back up to the top, and after a few more tries, Nate behind the camera says, we got it. I run back down, and sure enough, it's a perfect circle. <laughs> it's insane. Literally perfect. Dude, that's by far the best photo I've ever taken in my life. Okay, we're probably not going to get something as cinematic as that, but we're going to try to make the portal. So in this video, the dude has a light bar. I don't have one of those, but I do have a studio light that I just tied to a string. So I'm going to use this instead and just kind of swing it around. Now, in case you didn't know, these photos are made by taking a picture over a longer period of time, which is why you see me trying to stand as still as possible here, because if I move, the photo will be blurred. All right, let's check this out. <laughs> That's sick. And if you think that's cool, just wait till we get to drawing an animal using this technique. But for now, let's try this video. You keep it natural, stay in your bag like you wearing satchels. Hey, baby, you a guy saying, guy saying, guy saying, just missing the sandals. But still, you ain't missing much. Put your hands on my back, there's a different touch. But your to my plate, I don't skip the lunch. I don't skip the brush, not the dinner neither. And we had that's pretty cool. I proceeded to set up my tripod for the photo and I copied the exact settings used and turned on my iPhone torch to get the beams. Oh my god, that's sick. My mind is blown by how insane this is. Like, seriously, I've never done long exposure like this before. This is crazy. So to break it down, he used the light kind of like this and then just kind of moved it as the camera was exposing the photo. Let's try it out. I was honestly impressed with this since it's basically my first go at light painting, but it was only a warm up for what happened next. So to do this, I first had to get the design I wanted to do down. So I got a big piece of paper and started to practice. Now there were two designs that I wanted to do. An easy one, which was this cat, and a second one, which was a little harder, which was a kangaroo. Because, you know, we're in Australia, why not? Now it was just down to practice. A lot of the attempts just straight up didn't go well, and I was getting a little bit worried that I wouldn't be able to do this. Like this guy literally in his bio says he's been doing it for like 10 years. I've got like an hour of experience tops right now. Two days of practice later, I was ready. Oh my God, that looks so cute. <laughs> we actually got that one basically first go and it's, it's actually, it's pretty accurate and it's actually kind of cute. So then I spent the next 30 minutes working on the kangaroo design.
Oof. Okay, <laughs> let's try this one again. We got it! <laughs> All right, this one worked. This one, it actually looks like kangaroo. That's sick. I thought this was gonna take way longer than it did, but we got it and that is a sick photo. All right, this was an awesome learning experience. Big shout out to all the creators and original videos down below.